hi guys <laughs> welcome back to my channel today I thought I'd go ahead and do a stir fried chicken with white rice and I'm gonna show you guys how I prepare it so yeah first of all I've got my ingredients here I've got my chicken here I've got chicken breast got some lemons to wash the chicken I'm gonna be putting sweet corn this is some frozen ones I need to put that back in the freezer until I'm ready to use it got sweet peppers here some people call it bell peppers got onion bean sprout got soya sauce the seasoning chicken seasoning all-purpose seasoning bit of black pepper I'm gonna put tiny 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 very tiny bit of salt I've got a bit of ginger here some garlic and um, some rice I am gonna do I've got these two packs of rice I think they're the same one I'm gonna try not finish them up so I'm gonna use them um yeah and I am gonna do the chicken and rice separately okay guys I've got my chicken breast here two pieces of chicken breast I'm just gonna cut them in really thin slices very thick piece of chicken so I am gonna actually split them in two like that those size already washed it and cleaned it up there's still little bits that I need to trim off as I go along so basically that's the size I'm aiming for okay guys as you can see my chicken is cut up in small pieces and first and foremost I am going to be putting ooh, I don't know if you guys can see a tiny bit of salt on just a tiny bit just to bring the flavor up but because of all the seasoning I do not want to put too much next small amount of black pepper as well don't really measure guys I just use my initiative when I'm cooking um got all purpose and put a small amount on there and a small amount of chicken seasoning don't want to go too crazy with the seasoning on the chicken maybe later on when I put other ingredients in I will top it up but you know if you put too much seasoning on the chicken it's going to be too salty every bite you take so I'm being very cautious not to put too much in so so far we've got our dry ingredients now I'm gonna put some soya sauce in which one have I got I've got a dark soya sauce do that much for now Then I'm going to put some olive oil on. I'm 
and I'm also going to chop my garlic and ginger which I haven't and pop that on and mix it all together and leave it for about 10-20 minutes to marinate so we're just basically cutting the jar the garlic and the ginger into really tiny pieces and pop it in as well stir it all together to be marinated so basically guys I've put the <clears throat> chicken to marinate earlier I mentioned about the ginger and garlic I didn't end up putting them in We've got a bit of ginger and garlic here mixed up with a tiny amount of um, scotch bonnet pepper um, I didn't put it on the marinating, marinating process because when I'm frying the chicken I'm kind of looking for a brownie effect on the chicken and I didn't want to burn the garlic and the the ginger so yeah what I'm doing now is trying to get the sweet peppers or as we call it in the UK I'm trying to prep them as well now today but it's heat heating up very well I've got the marinated chicken there I think I've marinated for about 20 minutes so yeah and I've got my ingredients there ready to go Adding a small amount of 
Saying you guys can hear in the background. It's a stupid that flavour that you can't be tiny. Tiny. So I don't want um, everything to overcook, I want it to have a bit of time, so I'll just add that sweet corn in there. more soy sauce I'm going to give it a little chance for the heat to start building back up This is the last ingredient that's going to go in, the bean sprout. And I'm going to add my left, um, that juice that I poured out earlier. The bean sprout is giving it a lot of liquid as well, but it looks amazing. More or less done now. Just call me Rosie Lee. <laughs> yeah, I'm really looking forward to dinner today because I know it's going to be yummy. Finishing result. How gorgeous is that? I'm so looking forward to dinner. I've tasted a bit and it tastes fantastic hear you guys screaming through the camera going so are you gonna be eating all of that miss rosie lee <laughs> and the answer is no no that's not my dinner but yeah um i'll be looking forward to dinner so thank you guys so so much for watching keep the comments coming keep the like coming guys i really appreciate every one of you guys that watch my videos and subscribe to my channel um yeah until the next video oh by the way before I forget let me just quickly say basically I keep having to <laughs> mention about the giveaway because every time I think I haven't done it correctly and clearly so basically guys the person that's gonna win there's two people that's going to um get one of the bonnets one like I said before in my previous um, vlog one of them I know who that is this is the first person that ever ever commented on my channel don't know why I kept my hand up like that <laughs> and the second person is the person that is um, on my Instagram as a follower and a subscriber and my channel so basically what I need you guys to do and I am going to mention it again but I want to mention it here as well very clearly and in my next video so what I need you guys to do is to be subscribed to my channel and a follower on my Instagram 
and I want you to put on my Instagram as soon as my giveaway video is up hashtag hashtag rose bonnet and on the giveaway vlog as well hashtag rose bonnet I'm trying to process all of it my email address is on my YouTube channel so that's how I want the second person when I announce the winner to send me an email and um, with a, their address so I can actually send the giveaway off to them so it's gonna be the bonnet and I'll put another little thing or two in just to show you guys my appreciation um, yeah I might not do a giveaway for another long period of time as my channel grow then I'll decide when but this time I was so excited um, that I got past the 50 points so I really wanted to show my appreciation in that way so thank you guys again for watching I'm gonna this is where I'm gonna end today's cooking with me etc <laughs> yeah because I'm really looking forward to get stuck in into my food. So until next time, take care guys. Um, look after yourself. If you can't look after yourself, you can't look after anyone else. Bye for now guys.